Check this. Oh, okay. I think we talked about this. I think we had this exact, yeah, exact conversation. conversation. <laughs> yep. You're right. It's been a long week. It has. Bear with us. Wife Patrol may have skipped hungry and gone straight to hangry. Yep. Well, we are off and underway. Sportsman E-Buggy A-Main. Oh, all sorts of carnage in the first turn in this one. And all sorts of carnage off the triple. Somebody just going from the uh, front straight to the back there on that one. I thought you meant, like, the literal front straight. Nope. <laughs> Here they come back around. Tyler, that kind of looks like your car out front. Mm, okay. Pink and white with yellow wheels. That's fair. A bunch of colors that probably shouldn't go together. Here it comes. And oh, yeah. I had a paint job like that a little yeah. while back. Mike Amos is going to be out front leading the way. Preston Phelan in the number two spot. V win in the number three spot now. Ever Lobos in the four. Madison Bay, Romero, Bartlett, Maurer, Zega. Rounding out your top ten as of right now. I really hope V gets on the podium because I just I want to interview him again. It was so fun. <laughs> Well, here they come around, up and over the triple now. Preston Phelan around the outside, the green and blue, trying to make a move, and he does. Oh, but they come up short. Phelan dropping back to the number. Oh, no, he takes Phelan's over up in the lead. Yeah, he takes over the lead. From my local track, Thornhill Raceway. Mike Amos in the number two spot now. Fee Long win in the number three spot. Oh, trouble for Mike Amos. Amos goes upside down after the triple on the back side. Oh, man, a tough turn, Marshall, right there. And that, I believe, is going to move Cameron Madsen up into the number two spot, if I'm not mistaken. As we're coming back around here, FRC Charlie Mack letting us know Fee is barely seven years old. Seven. Oh, yeah. Okay. So he's younger than I thought he was. Here he comes back around right now. This is going to be Preston Phelan out front. Phelan, your race leader. He had a little bit of trouble this lap as well. Mike Amos in the number two spot. Oh, I see one car. Oh, that was Roman carrying a car back to where it belonged. <laughs> it's Phelan Lobos, Amos, Zega, Maurer, Rose, Wilder, win. Oh, in trouble there. That's Phelan. Phelan having all sorts of trouble here. Oh, more trouble. The oh. turn marks are getting hit. They're trying to get him back going again. Phelan losing a lot of time on that one. Uh-oh. As they make their way back around here, Preston Phelan may have handed over the lead to Ever Lobos. No, Mike Amo is back to the front now. Chris Zaga up into second, Ever Lobos into third. There goes Preston Phelan in fourth. The battle for second and third just ahead of him on the triple there. So first, second, and third, and here is your battle. One, two, and three. Over the double they go. Amos comes up a little bit, or Amos jumping over the top there. Zega, I believe, dropping back to the number three spot. Back and forth they go. And now it's all changing up once again. Mike Amos back to the front here in this one. Oh, Amos. Oh, oh, trouble. First and second collide. Oh, right behind the turn marks. And he doesn't even know it's there. That's going to drop Mike Amos back to the three spot. Zega out front. Lobos in second. Amos in third. Armin from 15th on the grid all the way up to fourth, and he is only six seconds out of the lead right now. So Zega, Lobos, Amos, Monogian, and Rose, top five. But we got a Pico America instant replay. Check out some of the carnage. Right here getting sideways. Ooh. That would have been a beautiful pass right there. It really there. would have. And then this right here. Turn Marshall just watching his zone. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, Dunford coming in with the hat. Yeah. Four ten down, five fifty left to go. Zega Lobos, one and two. Armin now from fifteenth on the grid all the way up to third. Jeff Rose in fourth. Cameron Madsen in fifth. Coming back around down the front stretch. That is Chris Zega, your race leader here with 5.30 left to go. On the right-hand side, he goes double, double, single. Down the back stretch, Ever Lobos in second. Jeff Rose in third. 
So now that battle between Jeff Rose and Armin and Cameron Madsen, third, fourth, and fifth starting to heat up a little bit. They work their way around here. Five minutes down, five to go. Zega Lobos, Madsen now up into third, Jeff Rose in fourth, and Armin in fifth. So that battle right now for third, fourth, and fifth, getting set down the back straight, maybe we can head over to that. Zega out front lead the way, Ever Lobos in the number two spot. Oh, your race leader there, heading down the back section of 4.15 left to go. So it's Zega, Lobos, Madsen, Rose, and Wynn. Top five. Fast lap of the race is Madsen in third with a 32.777. Uh-oh. Looks like Fee may have shut off. Not a good sign for Fee there as he was sitting in fifth. It was good while it lasted. 3.40 left to go here in this one. Nope, that was not Fee. That was somebody else. So Fee up to third. Wow, okay. Well, we'll see if we can find Fee on the track here in this one. The, yeah, the, sh the shutoff was Madsen. He was running third. No longer running third. Wow, that was really good insight from me, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Just really solid. Yep. Ever Lobos down the front stretch now. Chris Zaget down the front stretch. Fee Long working his way onto the left-hand side. And there goes Fee down the front stretch. Oh, Fee tumbling down the front straight. Oh, goodness. Lands back on his wheels. Come on, Fee. Hold on to it. 255 left to go here in this one. Fee Long win. Looking for a podium finish here. Seven years old. Barely. Barely seven. I barely seven. It's Lobos, Zega, B Long Win, Mike Amos, Jeff Cooper, Jeff Rose, Preston Phelan, Victor Bay, Mike Maurer, and Tab Wilder, your top 10. Two twenty left to go here in this one. Lobo, Zega, and win. One, two, and three. You may get your wish here. I may. As uh, Fee looking for a podium finish. Looking pretty solid right now. He's got a 4.6 second lead over Jeff Cooper in fourth. Mike Amos in the number five spot. Oh, a minute 10 left to go here in this one. Oh, you race the leader. Having a little mistake there. And 50 seconds left to go. Chris Zega, he's got company coming up behind him now. Ever Lobos right there behind him. 45 seconds to go. And Fee not far back from them. Here they come down the back straight. They go right now. Chris Zega out front. And look at this. Oh, up and over the double. They go. What a move to the inside. Oh, first and second get tangled up together. 
Zaga gets tangled up. Here comes Fee. Fee going to be right there behind him. 25 seconds to go. Your top three drivers all right there together. Oh, second place comes up short. Fee moves up to second now. Fee takes over the second place spot. Down the front straight they go. Fee win. Down the front stretch. On to the right side of the track. This is going to be their final lap. Over the triple they go. Try to triple over Fee now. Ever Lobos back up into the number two spot. This is perhaps the greatest race we've seen at the DNC. Oh, Fee goes upside down. That's going to allow Lobos up to the number two spot. He's got his sights set now on Zega. Here they come back around. Zega makes a little mistake up and over the double. Who is it going to be in this one? Oh, dive into the inside. First and second. Zega and win. Both get together. Coming across the line now. Your winner, Chris Zega. Ever Lobos coming around for the number two spot and Fee long win. Wow, what a race right there. A fantastic run for all of those drivers right there. Jeff Cooper will finish fourth, Mike Amos fifth, Victor Bay sixth, Preston Phelan, Jeff Rose, Mike Mauer, Tab Wilder, your top 10. An amazing run right there. Wow. Well, let's send it down here with an AKA race report on the driver's stand, Tyler Hooks. All right, guys, Tyler Hooks here with the AKA pit report after Sportsman Electric Buggy. We're here with Mr. Fee Win. How was your run, Fee? Good. It was pretty good. Uh, you ended up finishing third. Do you want to thank your parents? Um, yeah. And you've got one more main to go tonight, and it's a long one. Are you excited? Um, yeah. All right, well, I'll let you go get ready for that run. Good job, Fee. I'm really proud of you. Good job, buddy. Ooh. All right, second place. Okay. All right, we're here with Ever Lobo, second place finisher in Sportsman Electric Buggy. How was that run, man? Man, that was rough. Rough <laughs> track is we we from Georgia and uh, different different dirt. So it's red clay is different. This is something we never done, but it's fun. I mean, something different. And I'm glad I got second. So why not? All right. Well, considering that you live on the opposite side of the country, is there anybody you want to thank from home? Yeah, everybody in Guatemala. I'm from Guatemala, and um, yeah, everybody over there. So, so you know, just hi and thank for all the support. Congratulations. Thank you so much. All right. And our winner. Chris Zaga. Chris Zaga. I was trying to figure out how to pronounce your last name. I don't want to screw it up. Um, How was your run, Mr. Zaga? It was tough. Super rough track. Just slow. Double single everything. Just try not to flip. That was the name of it. You know. So do you want to thank anybody from home? I don't know where you're from. I'm from Burbank. So no, no really thanking anybody. You know, just, you know, everybody who's racing out today. It was fun. All right, well, congratulations. It goes several great with your buddies. Thanks, guys.